In 500 feet, turn left onto Plum Canyon Road. So this is FSD Beta 11.3.1 on test loop 2, which is a, has a couple of uncontrolled left turns. Now turn left onto Plum Canyon Road. It's not super busy. I want to see how it does. We've got no one coming from the left. It's got a creep from the, to see the right. Okay, now I've got a car coming from the left. It's clear to the right. But it won't be for long. Uh, there's too much. Now that I've got two more cars coming from the left, and I've got a whole bunch coming from the right. Okay, it's going, but I got a crap load of cars coming from the right. Okay, I'm intervening. It's leaving its butt out in the lane, and there's cars coming. Still too aggressive with that turn. In 500 feet, turn right onto Golden Valley Road. Okay, now turn there it goes. Right onto oh, Golden the, Valley Road. Cancel. Okay, I'm intervening. Hesitation entering right turn lane. In 1,000 feet, turn right onto Detter Lane. So it should be turning the turn signal on because we're going to turn right and we're decelerating. So it leaves it really late there. slow turn but that's okay now it cannot do 28 i'm going to turn it down manually now turn left onto clementine drive okay it doesn't need the turn signal here and it shouldn't come In to a complete stop feet, it can't creep right around this turn perfect circle see that was nice that's improved Again, it just needs to creep and keep moving. It doesn't need to stop. It's coming to a complete stop. Okay, I'm just gonna push it because there is no cross traffic. It's just a right, 90 degree right turning in a residential road. Now this one, it needs to stop because there could be cut traffic coming over the left. Now turn right onto Satsuma Circle. Better lane control appears in, in this little neighborhood. It's all clear to the left. It's taking its time though. There we go. Now let's see how it does on lane control to get back up to this main road and turn right. Keep, there we go. Now turn right onto okay, Much lane. better. Much better there. Okay, nice. Now let's see how it handles this left turn. In 500 feet, turn left onto Golden Valley Road. So previously it would kind of go really wide right to make the left, impacting the ability for someone to make the right turn up now here. Turn left onto Golden it needs Valley to stick Road. left, much better prediction. Yes, that's much better. Okay, now we've got a bit of traffic. I've got a lot of traffic coming from the left and I don't see anything from the right yet. Okay, after this truck, it can, it's clear. Nope, it's got another car coming high speed. Okay. It could go now. Not bad. Yeah, that was pretty close to what I would have gone. Well done on that one. Okay, <laughs> the left turn onto Plum Canyon with this light. I'm starting to see it make the decision to get in the right, right hand most left turn lane. See, for this example, it should stay in the right hand most turn, turn left turn lane. See, it's getting all the way over again. I mean, it's okay, there's nothing wrong with it, but it just has to make another lane change after the turn.
here comes our light. Let's see what happens. I've got no one to my right, so it's got lots of room to play here. Okay, so nice left turn. No braking here, which is good, but it's really dragging. Oh, it's got the speed limit wrong. Okay, it should be moving itself over. There it goes. In 1,000 feet, turn right onto Vine Joyce Drive. Okay, now it never likes getting in this right turn lane, which is also a bike lane. Now turn right onto Vine Joyce Drive. Yeah, still having. There it goes. And right turn. Perfect. So there we go. FSD Beta 11.3.1 on Test Loop 2.